trucking industry hauls over 70% of the freight in the United States, creating a $732 billion industry that is the lifeblood of our economy. In a time when supply chain issues are driving up the cost of goods around the world, the demand for truck drivers has never been greater. In a limited series from Idaho Public Television, we explore high demand jobs and career opportunities for Idaho's youth. In this digital short, we spend a few minutes with Bill Larson from Knife River Trucking to witness the operation of his rig and learn about his experiences as a truck driver. Hi, I'm Bill. I work for Knife River Trucking. This is one of our newer trucks. This is a 2021, we call this a super dump. It's just like a dump truck, except it has extra wheels and trailing arms and things like that. And primarily, we use this truck for paving, um, hauling material to job sites, things like that. It's a brand new truck. It's got all the features and everything you'd want in the new car. So now we're back inside the truck here. Um, like I said, this is a 2021 truck, so it has everything. It has start smart steering wheel where you control your cruise control and your stereo. It has Bluetooth. It has XM radio. It's climate controlled. It's new trucks have come a long way and uh, they're really comfortable. So let me show you how this thing operates. We'll start her up and show you how we dump out. So we just come over here and we engage the PTO. And then there's just a couple switches that uh, make the box go up and down. So normally you gotta be careful, you know, you make sure you're running power lines, things like that, but it's uh, kind of a straightforward process and that's how we move a lot of dirt in a very short period of time. I'm actually a fourth generation truck driver. So, you know, dad, grandparents, the whole thing. But I've always loved it. I've, it's all I've ever really wanted to do. You know, from being a little kid playing in the yard with trucks to riding with my dad. I enjoy the variety of it. You know, every day's different. I see different things all the time and I experience different things. And I've gone up to Lolo Pass. I've gone to Twin Falls. I've been down to Bliss. I, I, I've seen parts of the state that people have never heard of. And, um, and I get paid to do it. The J.R. Simplot Company is a leader in the agricultural industries that enrich our planet. As a farm-to-table company, distributing the products that nourish our lives is an essential part of their commitment to food and agriculture. Working with more than 200 growers worldwide to produce 5 billion pounds of raw potatoes requires efficient logistical coordination to ensure every spud is delivered with care. In this video, we spend time with Larry Crane of Simplot Trucking to understand the operation of his rig and the role he plays in helping the JR Simplot Company fulfill its contribution to feeding our world. Hi, I'm Larry. I'm at Simplot Transportation. I'm here to show you how these hoppers work. And everything's pretty much well hands-free and we ought to open the tarp to get prepared to load the potatoes either at the load side at the sellers and or during harvest and that is a very busy time of the year which is fun the opportunity came to go to work with simplot 30 some years ago and i've been here ever since it's been fun exciting and uh, you have a schedule to keep and you take care of what you're driving and your equipment and they take care of you and here we are again on our next step. And it's, like I said, it's all hands-free, pretty much. You get prepared to load the potatoes. As you see, the door, just with the push of a button, opens up. And we haul 72,000 pounds in these big trailers like this, of potatoes. That's a lot of baked potatoes, and that's a lot of french fries, if you dice them up. And that's another exciting thing, is that you know you're involved in help feeding the world makes me feel good and with our industry and the potatoes farmers are everywhere and you've got to go to a lot of different places and it's challenging to get in and out of places and it tests your skills and the more you do that the better you feel about yourself and you feel that you've done a good job and here we are again another hands-free operation as we unload the potatoes at the plant we there are ran off of hydraulics and the doors open with the push of a button. This is fun. And at the end of the day, you 
they're home with your family. And that's one thing about Simplot that, you know, that they thrive on is to try to get you there for your dinner at the end of the day. The trucking industry drives Idaho's economy. With more than 200 million tons of freight hauled annually, over $2 billion in wages are paid out to the industry's workforce. To understand the challenges and rewards of a career in this industry, we spent a day with Corey Henson of Gary Amoth Trucking, an independent company with over 160 trucks that boasts a diversified fleet of trailers and equipment. The biggest thing about driving a truck is it's a sense of freedom. Been in every state in, in the nation, of the lower 48. My name is Corey Henson. I'm a driver for Gary Amoth Trucking. First wheel I ever turned in a truck was in 1989. In the trucking world, as long as you are from point A to point B, and a lot of time, you're your own boss. The person who wants to get out of bed and, and go to work hard and push as hard as he can uh, to get the miles every day, he's going to make the most money. This is a 2020 Western Curtain Side trailer. Down, up and down the road and navigating it around is uh, challenging, you know, especially today with all the traffic. You train yourself to look very far down the road as you're driving. You're on high alert at all times. You never know what car's coming across the median. You never know what car's going to pull out in front of you. In the northwestern states where we're licensed for 84,000, it can haul about 50,000 pounds. And do two um, locks on each end, it slides to either end, so you just come with a heister and set your uh, lumber, uh, roofing, any kind of building materials on it. It has a built-in microwave, a built-in flat screen TV, built-in refrigerator. We have the bunk heaters so you don't have to idle the truck. Also, if it, your oil temperature gets down to five degrees, it automatically starts the truck. If your batteries get down to below 11 amps, I believe, it just starts the motor. And you're ready to go truck. I've taken my kids to Six Flags, you know, Florida, and different places you take a day off down there. As far as a career, if you're really serious about it, you'll get out of exactly what you put into it. Seen some amazing things. To learn more about high demand careers in our state, visit Next Steps Idaho a site where you can research careers that suit your skills and passions. And if you're an Idaho resident, check out Idaho Launch to apply for funding to support your training. This production was made possible through a grant from the Idaho Workforce Development Council with additional funding from the Friends of Idaho Public Television.